Hello internet world, in today's video I'm going to show you three products from Sabrent that are really going to feed your camera and also feed your productivity. If you use a camera regularly, these are definitely products you should check out. Now they were all kindly sent in free of charge by Sabrent, no money's changed hands, they haven't asked me to say anything in particular, I just really like this sort of tech and I can't wait to share my opinion with you. So let's get on with the reviews. This is the Sabrent USB 3.2 Type-C and Type-A SD memory card reader. It's called the SD Express 7.1. If we take a look around on the back of the box, you can see the model number here, which is the CRSDX7. And this is a really good memory card reader. You can see on the bottom of the box here, it says Windows and Mac OS compatible. Also works with Linux, supports SDXC, USB on the go. It's got USB Type-C and it is plug and play. Now inside the box, you get this little leaflet. You also get a couple of cables. You get a USB-C to USB-C cable, and you get a second cable, which is USB-C to USB-A. And then of course, you get the memory card reader itself. This is for SD memory cards. It's a full metal enclosure, very, very nicely made. We've got these chamfered edges. It just feels top quality. Of course, we've got the memory card slot on there. And then if we take a look around on the back, it says the model number on the back or on the bottom. We've got two little rubberized feet as well. It's a simple device, but where this really excels is in its speed and also its reliability. So we've got top-notch build quality. I've used this for just over three weeks now in total, and it hasn't failed me once. It's read my memory cards very, very quickly. I've used the USB-C to USB-C connection direct to my MacBook Pro, but of course you can, can connect it to a Windows or Linux computer as well. And it works brilliantly, very fast file transfer, much better than connecting your camera directly to your computer. This is gonna give you much faster transfer speeds. So this particular product from Sabrent is well worth picking up. This is the Sabrent CRCSDM. It's a USB Type-C SD and micro SD card reader, supports UHS-2. If we look across the bottom here, you can see it's Windows and Mac OS compatible. It should be Linux compatible as well, although I haven't tested that. It reads SD cards and micro SD cards. It's USB Type-C and it's plug and play. If I quickly turn the box over, you can see the model number here that I mentioned earlier, CRCSDM. Now, this supports USB 3.2 Gen 1, so nice fast transfer speeds. Inside the box, you simply get the product itself and this little product leaflet. The product itself is a nice metal enclosure. I think we've got some plastic capping across the front here, and then we've got this integrated cable. I haven't measured this, but it's round about sort of 15 centimeters long. So very nice captive cable, terminated in USB-C with a bit of Sabrent branding on there as well. And then we've got the actual enclosure itself, which is really nicely made. Again, some Sabrent branding on there. And then if we take a look on the underside, it's got the model number on the underside and also the serial number. And then across the front here, it's quite simply got the two card slots. So this allows you to read your micro SD cards, maybe from an action camera or a smartphone, and also full size SD cards as well. And for such a compact device, it's really good that they've managed to fit these two slots in. This is a very, very small portable card reader. And instead of putting your memory cards uh, directly in from perhaps your camera, so maybe you'll connect your camera up to computer, you can take them out of your camera, pop them in this reader, and you're gonna get much faster and more reliable transfer speeds. If you create a lot of content with something like a GoPro or a DJI action camera or a mirrorless camera, something like that, then this is definitely something you should pick up. It's much, much better to use a dedicated memory card reader. So this is a great little product from Sabrent and it comes highly recommended. If you create a lot of content, a lot of video content on your camera, or take a lot of photos, a decent quality, fast, reliable memory card is very important. This is the Sabrent Rocket V60. I've been using this for about three weeks now, and it's proved very reliable with really good transfer speeds. And it's supported up to 4K resolution video footage I've been recording at 100 megabits per second. This particular one is a 256 gigabyte version, 
and you can get it in other capacities as well. And you can see the model number on the back of the box there. Inside the box, you get this inner case, which is a nice sort of metal case that's gonna keep your memory card nice and safe when it's not in use. You can see here is a sticker where it says the capacity and then round on the back here, you can see it says the model number on the back of the case as well. And this opens up to reveal your memory card. It's got a little bit of padding in the lid there. And this is the memory card itself. If you can see here, it's an SDXC2 V60 Class 10 UHS-3. And it supports up to a 270 megabytes per second read speed. As I mentioned earlier, this is the 256 gigabyte capacity, which is probably the most popular capacity that I use although with some cameras I drop down to 128 gigabytes. This is available in lots and lots of different capacities. And when we turn this over, you can see the extra row of contacts on the memory card, and that gives you some really fast read and write transfer speeds. Ideal if you record in 4K. Also ideal if you take lots of photos and you need those fast sort of uh, shutter burst rates uh, and sort of emptying out that buffer nice and quickly on your camera. I know that that sometimes relies on the camera tech and specifications itself, but having a good memory card is really gonna give you the best chance of capturing great quality footage. This is the Rocket V60 from Sabrent, and I highly recommend it. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do hit the like button. Let me know in the comments section below which one you're gonna be picking up for yourself. And if you want to make a purchase, please do check out the links in the video description. There's also a link down there to the manufacturer's website. Thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in another video very, very soon.